Hi, thank you for joining us for this virtual reading, our first. Chill Bucket Productions started in 2009 as a co-producer on Play in a Day with CYT North Idaho. Shortly after, we produced Improv Off, an improv competition for high schools. And just a few years ago, Dakota and I decided to branch out and actually write a mission statement. Chill Bucket Productions is a theatrical group dedicated to advancing classic theater and showcasing our history to inform our present, bringing current issues and thought-provoking theater to new and old audiences alike. After that, we began producing a Valentine's Day cabaret and readings in the Westchester County area. As we continue to build, we couldn't be more excited to be in a position where producing an event like this is possible. We'd like to thank this amazing group of performers for bringing this project to life. Awaken Sing is performed in three acts without an intermission. Here's Dakota to tell you more about this great story. Awake and Sing is an American drama written by Clifford Odets. It takes place in 1933 in the Longwood section of the Bronx, New York. Odets studied and worked as an actor for years while pitching his plays to colleagues like Lee Strasberg. Awake and Sing premiered in 1935 at the Belasco Theater. Amongst the original Broadway cast are some of the greatest features and actors in history. Sanford Meisner, Stella Adler, Luther Adler, and John Garfield. The play became a huge success, praised for its colloquial style. Odette's wrote a play about what middle-class New Yorkers were going through during the Great Depression, and he used words that were familiar to the people. A play about the people for the people, which focused on themes like realism versus idealism, perception versus reality, financial hardships, familial drama, none of which were a brand new idea. But Odette's was relevant. He showed us the different viewpoints, even within a family, and the current struggles of the time that most Americans could relate to. It was real, it was raw, it was theater at its finest. Without further ado, we'd like to bring to you a play with many parallels to our current crisis, Awake and Sing. Act One. The time is 1933. The family is finishing supper at an apartment in the Bronx in New York City. Where's advancement down the place? Work like crazy. Think they see it? You drop dead first. Never mind, son. Merit never goes unrewarded. You know, Teddy Roosevelt used to say, as long as a man works. 30 years a haberdashery clerk. <laughs> all I want is a chance to reach first base. That's all? Stuck down in that joint on 4th Avenue? A stock clerk in a silk house. Just look at Eddie. I'm as good as he is, pulling in 250 a week for 48 minutes a day, a headliner, naming all the papers. That's what you want, Ralphie? Your name in the papers? I want to make my mind up about things, be something. Didn't I want to take up tap dancing too? Go take uh, lessons. Who stopped you? On what? On what? Save money. Sure, five dollars a week for expenses and the rest in the house. I can't even save for shoelaces. Oh, you mean we shouldn't have food in the house, but you'll make a jig on the street corner. I mean something. You also mean something when you studied on the drums, Mr. Smarty. <laughs> I don't know. Every other day to sit around with the blues and mud in your mouth? That's how it is. Life is like that. A cakewalk. <laughs> What's it get you? A four-car funeral. What's it for? What's it for? If life leads to a revolution, it's a good life. Otherwise, it's for nothing. Never mind, Pop. Pass me the salt. It's crazy. All my life, I want a pair of black and white shoes, and I can't get them. It's crazy. 
in a minute, I'll get up from the table. I can't take a bite in my mouth no more. Now, Mama, just don't excite yourself. I'm so nervous. I can't hold a, hand, a knife in my hand. Is that a way to talk, Ralphie? Don't Mama work hard enough all day? On my feet, 24 hours. On her feet what all do day. Do? Go to nightclubs with Greta Garbo? Then when I come home, I can't even have my own room? Sleep on a day bed in the front room. Oh, starting up that stuff, stuff again. When Henny here marries, you'll have her room. I should only live to see the day. Me too. This morning, the sink was full of ants. Where they come from, I just don't know. I, I thought it was coffee grounds. And then they all started moving. You gave the doggy. I gave the doggy. You got dropsies tonight. Company's coming. You can buy a ticket for 50 cents and win a fortune. A man came in the store. It's, it's the, uh, the Irish sweepstakes. What? Like a raffle, only different. A man comes in. Who spends 50 cents for Irish raffles? They threw out a family on Dawson Street today. All the furniture on the sidewalk. A fine old woman with gray hair. Come in, Ralphie. A butcher on Beck Street won $80,000. $80,000. Excuse my expression. You're bug house. I see him in the paper on one ticket. 765 Beck Street. Impossible. He did. Yes, he did. He says he'll take his own mother to Europe. And Austrian. And uh Europe? Yeah, 6% on 80,000. 4,800 a year. I'll give you money. Buy your ticket in Henny's name. Say you can't tell. Lightning never struck us yet. If they win on B Beck Street, we could win on Longwood Avenue. If it rains pearls, who would work? Another county we hear from. I forgot, Beauty, uh, Sam Feinschreiber sent you a present. Since I brought him for supper, he just can't stop talking about you. What's that mm -hmm. Maki bothering about? Who needs him? He's a very lonely boy. So I'll sit down and bust out crying because he's lonely. He'd marry you, one, two, three. Too bad about him. Mmm, chocolate peanuts. Lost weekend special, two for 39. You could think about it. It wouldn't hurt. <laughs> To quote Mo Axelrod, don't make me laugh. Never mind laughing. It's time you already had in your head a serious thought. A oh, girl, 26, don't grow younger. When I was your age, it was already a big family with responsibilities. <laughs> Maybe that's what ails you, Mom. Don't you feel well? Because I'm laughing? I feel fine. It's just funny, that poor guy sending me presents because he loves me. I think it's very, very nice. Sure. Swell. Mrs. Marcus's Rose is engaged to a Brooklyn boy, a dentist. He came in his car today. A little dope should get such a boy. Tell you what, Mom, I saved for a new dress, but I'll take you and Pop to the Franklin. Don't need a dress. From now, I'm planning on staying nights. Hold everything. What's the matter? A bed bug bit you suddenly? It's a good bill. Belle Baker. Maybe she'll sing Eli, Eli. He was going to a movie. Forget it. Let's go. I see in the papers, um, Sophie Tucker took off 26 pounds. Mm. Beautiful business with Japan. Write a book, Pop. Come on, we'll go early for some good seats. Mo said you had a date with him for tonight. Axel Rod? I told him no, but he don't believe it. I'll tell him no for the next 100 years, too. Don't break appointments, Beauty, and hurt people's feelings. His hands go freewheeling. I don't know. People ain't the same. And oh, the whole world's changing right under our eyes. Presto. No manners. Like, like the great Italian lover in the movie. What was his name? Um, uh, the Sheik? But no one remembers? Jake? No. I can't stand it. There's an expression, strong as iron you like must be. Cockeyed world. Boys like you could uh, fix it someday. Look on the world, not on yourself so much. Every country with starving millions, no? In Germany and Poland, a Jew couldn't walk in the streets. Everybody hates air. Nobody loves I don't get that. For years, I have watched you grow up. Wait, you graduate from my university. Good cigars now for a nickel. After take Tootsie on the roof, what do you do? Don't know. You'll see the boys around the block? I'll stay home every night. 
Mama don't mean for you to be staying home every I'm night. I'm flying to Hollywood by a plane. That's what I'm doing. I don't like my boy to be seen with those tramps on the corner. Schloss is here, Mama, with the, with the garbage can. Come in here, Schlosser. Wait, I'll give him a piece of my mind. What's the matter with the dumbwaiters? Broken again? Mr. Vilma sends new ropes next week. I got a sore arm. He should live so long, you Mr. Wimmer. For seven years already, he's sending new ropes. No dumb waiter, no hot water, no steam. In a respectable house, they don't allow such conditions. In a decent house, dogs are not running to make dirty the hallway. Tootsie's making dirty? Our Tootsie is making dirty in the hall? I tell you yesterday again, you must not leave her. <laughs> Excuse me, do not yell at an old man. He's got more brains in his finger than you got, uh, I don't know where. Did you ever see he should talk to you, an old man? Awful. From now on, we don't walk up the stairs no more. You keep it so clean, we'll fly in the windows. I speak to Mr. Vimmer. Speak, speak. Tootsie walks behind me like a lady, anytime, any place. So goodbye, goodbye, Mr. Schlosser. I tell you that. I've worked very hard here. My arms is... Play all day in the kitchen, maybe. Give him back if he yells on you. Oh, <laughs> Annie, take care. Sure. Bye-bye. Valentino, that's the one. Never even had a birthday party. Every time I went and cried in the toilet when my birthday came. You're going to bed? No, I'm putting on a clean shirt. Why? I got a girl. Now, don't laugh. Who laughs? Since when? Three weeks. She lives in Yorkville with an aunt and uncle. Bunch of relatives, but no parents. I know a fun girl. Ah, but she's got me. Boy, I'm telling you, I can sing. Jake, she's like the stars. So beautiful. <laughs> you look at her and you cry. She's like French words. <laughs> we spent the, uh, went to the park the other night. Heard the band concert. Music. Oh, it got cold. I gave her my coat to wear. Uh, we just walked along like that, see, without a word, see. Oh, I've never been so happy in all my life. Uh, uh, got late. We just sat there. She looked at me. It, you, you know what I mean. <laughs> How a girl <laughs> looks at you right in the eye. I love you, she says, Ralph. <laughs> I took her home. Oh, I wanted to cry. That's how I felt. It's a beautiful thing. <laughs> you said a mouthful. Her name is? Blanche. A fine name. Bring her sometime here. Yeah, she's scared to meet mom. Why? You know mom's not letting my 16 bucks out of the house if you can, she can help it. <laughs> She'd take one look at Blanche and insult her in a minute. A kid who's got nothing? Boy chick. What's the diff? It's no difference a plain Burgoy's prejudice. But when they find out a poor girl, it, it, it ain't so kosher. They don't have to know I have a girl. What's in the end? Out I go. I don't mean maybe. And then what? Life begins. What life? Life with my girl. Boy, I could sing when I think about it. Her and me together, that's a new life. Don't make a mistake, a new death. What's the idea? Me, I'm the idea. Once I had in my heart a dream, a, a vision, but Come marriage, and then you forget. Children come. <laughs> Don't worry, and you Jake. Forget. Don't worry. Rem remember, a woman insults a man's soul like no other thing in the whole world. <laughs> well, I get so excited, and no one's saying I'm. Boy, trying to... Jake, wake up! <laughs> Be something. Make your life something good, for the love of an old man who sees in your young. Days, his new life. For such love, take the world in your two hands and make it like new. Go out and fight so life shouldn't be printed on dollar bills. A woman waits. Hey, I'm no fool. From my heart, I hope not. In the meantime. Uh, will you see who that is, will you? I don't want mom to catch me with a clean shirt. Come in. It's more Axelrod. Hello, girls. How's your whiskers? All dolled up? What's it, your weekly visit to the cat house? Please mind your business. Okay, sweetheart. 
If mom asks where I went. I know. Enjoy yourself. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. Who's home? Me. Good. I'll stick around for a few minutes. Where's Henny? She went with Bessie and Myron to a show. She what? You had a date? Here. I brought you some habla. Oh, well, thanks. Uh, I'll eat the piece after. So Ralph's got a dame? Hot stuff. Kid can't even play a card game. Mo, you're no good. A bum of the first water. To your dying day, you won't change. Where'd you get that stuff? No good. But I like you. Didn't I fight in France for democracy? <laughs> Didn't I get my goddamn leg shot off in the war the day before the armistice? Uncle Sam gave me the Order of the Purple Heart, didn't he? What do you mean, a no good? Excuse me. If you got an orange, I'll eat an orange. No orange and apple. No oranges, huh? What a dump. Bessie hears you once talk like this, she'll knock your head off. Henny went with, huh? She wants to see me squirm. Only I don't squirm for dames. Oh, you came to see her? What for? I got a present for our boyfriend, Myron. He'll drop dead when I tell him his gentle horse galloped 15 to one, he'll die. It really won the first time I remember. Where'd they go? A vaudeville by the Franklin. What's the special tonight? Someone tells a few jokes and then they forget the street is filled with starving beggars. What do they do, start a war? I don't know. You wanna know? What the hell you got all the, law, the looks for? It needs a new world. That's why they had the big war, to make a new world. They said, safe for democracy. Sure, every big general laying up in Paris Hotel with half a dozen broads pinned on his mustache. <laughs> democracy. I learned a lesson. An imperial war, do you know what this means? Sure, I know everything. By money, men, the interests must be protected. Who gives you such a rotten haircut? Please, give me for a cent a cigarette I didn't have since yesterday. Don't make me laugh. Don't look so tired all the time. You're a woe, always sore about something. And you? You got one thing. You can play pinochle. I'll take you over in a the game. Then you'll have something to be sore on. Who we'll wash dishes? I'll do them after. Ten cents a deal. Who's got ten cents? I got ten cents. I'll lend it to you. Commence. First time I had my hands on a pack in two days. Let me shake up these cards. I'll make them talk. You should live so long. Ever see oranges grow? I know a certain place. One summer, I laid under a tree. Let them fall right into my mouth. I listen from... La African, a big explorer, comes on a new land, O oh, Paradiso. From Act Four, this piece, Caruso stands on the ship and looks on Utopia. You hear, ah, O oh, Paradise, O oh, Paradise, on Earth, O oh, Blue Sky, O oh, Fragrant Air. Ask him, does he see any oranges? You come back so soon? And he got sick on the way. Hello, Mo. Take off the phonograph, Pop. Lay down. I'll call the doctor. You should see how she got sick on Prospect Avenue. Two weeks already she don't feel right. Mo. Go to bed, Henny. I'll sit here. Such a girl I never saw. Now you'll be stubborn? It's for your own good, beauty. Influenza. I'll sit here. You ever seen a girl should say no to everything. She can't stand on her feet, so... You don't know, yell in my ears. I hear... Nothing's wrong. I ate tuna fish for lunch. Hand goods. Last week, you also ate tuna fish? Yeah, I'm funny for tuna fish. Go to the show. Have a good time. I don't understand what I did to God. He blessed me with such children from the whole world. For Christ's sake, don't commit so much. Oh, you don't like it? No, I don't like it. That's too bad, Axelrod. Maybe it's better by a cigar store, friends. Here, we're different people. Don't give me that cigar store line, Bessie. I walked up five flights. Take out Henny, but my daughter ain't in your class, Axelrod. To see Myron. Did he? Did he mow? 
Did he what? Skyrocket. You bet on a horse? Paid 12 and a half to one. Paid 12 and a half to one. There, you, you hear that mama our horse came in. You see, it happens. And 12 and a half to one, just look at that. What the hell? Sure thing, I told you. If Mo said a sure thing, you couldn't bet a few dollars instead of 50 cents? <laughs> I, 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 I. I'm carrying 600 plunks in big denominations. Oh, thank you. Uncle Sam sends me 90 a month. So you save it? Run it up. Run it up, Axelrod. That's me. Well, the police should know how. All right, all right. Change 20, sweetheart. Can you make change? Don't be crazy. I'll meet a guy in Goldman's restaurant. I'll meet him and I'll come back with change. You can give it to me tomorrow when in the store. He'll come back. He'll come back. Lucky I bet some big bucks myself. Let's step out tomorrow night, paradise. Oh, that's a big percentage. If I pick the winner every day. Papa, did you take Tootsie on the roof? All right. Just look at that. A cakewalk. We can make so much no, more. No, I've got a splitting headache. Kenny, go in bed. I'll call Dr. Cantor. I'll sit here. And don't call that old Ignatz, because I won't see him. If you get sick, mama can't nurse you. You don't want to go to a hospital. He don't look sick, Bessie. It's a fact. The fever I see in her eyes. So he tells me no. Myron, call Dr. C Cancer. I don't want any doctor. I ain't sick. Leave me alone. Beauty, it's for your own good. Day in and day out pestering. Why are you always right and no one else can say a word? When you have your own children, you then you'll see. I'm not sick. Hear what I say? I'm not sick. Nothing's the matter with me. I don't want a doctor. What's the matter? Nothing. I told you. You told me, but... See much? Myron, put down the phone. Tell me what happened. Brooklyn Bridge fell down. I'm asking a question. What's happened, Mama? Listen to me. What the hell are you talking? Papa, take Tootsie on the roof. Ah! If he wants, he could stay here. What's wrong, Mama? Myron, your fine beauty's in trouble. Our society, lady. Trouble? I don't understand. What, 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 Look is in her face. Who's the man? The Prince of Wales. My gall is busting in me in two seconds. Shut up. Shut up. I'll jump out the window in a minute. Shut up. Oh, you don't know him. Bessie. He's a Bronx boy? From out of town. What do you mean? From out of town. A long time you know him? You were sleeping by a girl from the office Saturday night. Oh, you slept good, my lovely lady. You go to him and he'll marry you. That's what you say. That's what I say. He'll do it. Take my word, he'll do it. Where? Give her the letter. What? Dear sir, in reply to your request on the 14th, we can state that no Ben Grossman has ever been connected with our art. You don't even know where he is? No. Oh, stop crying like a baby, Myron. Like a play on the stage. To a mother, you couldn't say something before? I'm old fashioned. Like your friends, I'm not smart. I don't eat chop suey and run around Coney Island with tramps. Tomorrow night, bring Sam Feintriver for supper. Bring him for supper. I won't do it. Oh, you'll do it, my fine beauty. You'll do it. I'm not marrying a poor foreigner like him. Can't even speak an English word. Not me. I'll go to my grave without a husband. You don't say. We'll find you somewhere a millionaire with a pleasure boat. He's going to night school, Sam. For a boy only three years in the country, he speaks very nice. In three years, he put enough in the bank. A good living. This is serious. What then? I'm talking for my health. He'll come tomorrow night for supper. By Saturday, they're engaged. Such a thing you can't do. Who asked your advice? Such a thing <laughs> is what? The laws from the law. Don't talk, I am warning you. A man who don't believe in God with crazy ideas. So bad I never imagined you Maybe could be. If you talk so much, it wouldn't happen like this, you with your ideas. I'm a mother. I raise a family. They should have respect. Respect? Pee! Respect for the neighbor's opinion. You insult me, Bessie. Go in your room, Papa. 
Every ah. job he ever had, he lost because he's got such a big mouth. He opens his mouth and the whole Bronx could fall in. Everybody- Mama, they'll hear you down the dumb waiter. Longer not to hold a job for a week. Maybe you never heard charity starts at home. You ever heard it, Pop? All you know I heard then more yet. But Ralph, you don't make like you. Before you do it, I die first. He'll find the girl. He'll, he'll go in a fresh world with her. This is a house. Marx said it. Abolish such families. Go in your room, Papa. Ralph, you don't make like you. Go lay in your room with Caruso and the books together. All right. Go in your room. Someday I'll come out and I'll... They say, someday... You'll talk to me so fresh. I leave the house for good. You ever in your life seen it? He should dare, he should dare just say in the house another word. Your gall could bust from such a man. Go to sleep now, it won't hurt. Yeah. Cake, 65 four bits change. Come on, hand over half a buck. Who bit him? Um, <clears throat> we're soon losing our Henny, Mo. Why? What's the matter? She made her engagement. Is that so? Today it happens. He asked her. Did he? Who? Who's the corpse? It's a secret. In the bag, huh? Yeah. When a mother gives away an only daughter, it's no joke. Wait until you get married, you'll know. Don't make me laugh. When I get married, what I think a woman, tell them all. Cut them into little pieces like herring on a Greek salad. A guy in France had the right idea. Dropped his wife in a bathtub full of acid. <whistles> Down a pipe. Poof, not even a corset button left. Corsets don't have buttons. What's the great idea? Gone big time paradise? Christ, it's suicide. Sure, kids will have gold teeth, get fat, big in the tangerines. Shut your face. Who's it? Some dope pulling down 20 bucks a week? Cut your throat, sweetheart. Save time. Never mind your two cents, Axelrod. I say what I think. That's me. That's you, a lousy flower pusher who'd, deal, who'd steal the glasses off a blind man. Get hot. My God, do I need it to listen to this mutt shoot his mouth off? Please, honey, don't- Now wait a minute, sweetheart, wait a minute. I don't have to take that from you. Don't yell at her. For two cents, I'd spit in your eye. Here's two bits. Where are you going? For my beauty nap, Mussolini. Wake me up when it's asshole, apple blossom time in Normandy. Pretty, pretty, a sweet gal you're, honey. See the look in her eyes? You don't feel well. Can goods. So don't start with her. Like a battleship, she's got it. Not like other dames. Shove them and they lay, not her. I got a yen for her and I don't mean a Chinese coin. Listen, Axelrod, in my house, you don't talk this way. Either have respect or get out. When I think about it, maybe I'll marry her myself. You could. What do you mean, Mo? You ain't got sunburn, you heard me. Well, why don't you, Mo? An old friend of the family like you would be a blessing on all of us. You said she's engaged. Oh, but maybe she don't know her own mind. Say it's... I need a wife like a hole in the head. What's to know about women? I know. Even if I asked her, she wouldn't do it. A, a guy with one leg? It gives her the heebie-jeebies. I know what she's looking for. An arrow-collar guy. A hero, but one with a wad of jack. Only the two don't go together. But I got what it takes, plenty, and more where it comes from. That's right. She wants a millionaire with a mansion on Riverside Drive. So go fight City Hall. Cake? Cake. I'll make tea. But one thing, she's got a fine boy with a business brain. Caruso. No wet smacks. Fine girl. So burn that guy out in a month. I remember that song. Beautiful. Nora Bay sang it at the old Proctor's, 23rd Street. When is apple blossom time in Normandy? Do you want to see me crawl? My head on a plate she wants. A snowball of hell and chance got a better chance than that. Beautiful. 
match you for a quarter. Match you for any goddamn thing you got. What the hell kind of house ain't got an orange? Act two, one year later, Jacob is giving his son Mordecai a haircut. Mo and Ralph are reading newspapers as Bessie enters. Dinner's in half an hour, Morty. I got time. Doc, don't, don't get hair on the rug, Pop. What's mm. the matter? Shades up to the ceiling? Since when do I give a haircut in the dark? When you finish, pull it down. I like my house to look respectable. Ralphie, bring up two bottles of seltzer from Weiss. I'm reading the paper. Uncle Morty likes a little seltzer, please. I'm expecting a phone call. No, if it comes, you'll be back. What's the matter? Uh, take down the old bottles. Get that call if it comes. Uh, say I'll be right back. Uh, get Grandpa some cigarettes. OK. What's new in the paper, Mo? Still jumping out the high buildings like flies. The big shots who lost all their coconuts. <laughs> Suicides. Plenty can't take it. Good in a break, but you can't whip it in the stretch. I saw it happen Monday in my building. My hair stood up how they shoved them together like a pancake, a bankrupt manufacturer. No brains. Enough. All over the sidewalk. Someone said five, ten years ago I couldn't make for myself a living. I wouldn't believe. Wait, duck? For dinner? The best Long Island duck. I like goose. A duck is just like a goose, only better. I like goose. The next time you'll be for Sunday dinner, I'll make a goose. Smells good. I'm a great boy for smells. He's shamed once in a blue moon he should come to an only sister's house. Bessie, leave me live. You should be ashamed. Eh, quack, quack. No better to lay around Mecca Temple playing cards with the Masons. Bessie, don't you see Pop's giving me a haircut? You don't need no haircut. Look, two hairs he cut off. Pop likes to give me a haircut. If I said no, he don't forget it for a year, do you, Pop? But old man's like that. I still do a nail one job. Pop cuts hair to fit the face, don't you, Pop? For sure, Morty. To each face a different haircut. Custom built. No ready-made. A round face needs a special Oh, kind. graduate from EMT. Don't forget the shade. Hello? Who is it, please? Who is it, please? Miss Hirsch? No, he ain't here. No, I couldn't say when. For Ralph. A wrong number. Excuse me? Ralphie took another cut down the place yesterday. Business is bad. I saw his boss, uh, Harry Glickman, Thursday. I bought some velvets. They're coming in again. Do something for Ralphie down there. What can I do? I mentioned it to Glickman. He told me they squeezed out half the people. What's going to be the end? Myron's working only three days a week now. Conditions. And he's married with a baby. Money just don't come in. I never saw conditions should be so bad. Times will Times change. change. The only thing change is my underwear. <laughs> These years I got my share of gray hairs. <laughs> Popeye the sailor ate spinach and knocked out four bums. <laughs> I'll tell you the way I see it. The country needs a great man now, like a regular Teddy Roosevelt. What this country needs is a good five cent earthquake. So long labor lives, it should increase private gain. Listen, Papa, go talk on the street corner. The government give you free board for the rest of your life. I I'm surprised. Don't I send a five dollar check for Pop every week? Good for a couple more, not miss it. Ah, tell me jokes. Business is so rotten, I could just lay all day in a Turkish bath. Why did I come in here? I hear the bootleggers still do business, Mo. Wake up. I kissed bootleg and bye-bye two years back. For a fact? What kind of racket is it now? If I told you, you'd know something. Where's Sam? Sam in the kitchen. Sam, come take the diaper. How's the Mickey loose? <laughs> Sleeping. Ah, uh, that's life to a baby. He sleeps, gets it in the mouth, sleeps some more. To raise a family nowadays, you must be a damn fool. Never mind, never mind. A woman who don't raise a family, a, a girl should jump overboard. What's she good for? 
Mo, you like bothers you bad? It's okay, sweet Mo. It hurts him every time it's cold out. He's got four legs in the closet. Four wooden legs? Three. What's the big idea? Why not? Uncle Sam gives them out for free. Say, maybe if Uncle Sam gave out less legs, we could balance the budget. We'll not have a war so they wouldn't have to give out legs. Ah, oh, shame on you, Pop. Everybody knows war is necessary. Don't, Don't make me make laugh. Me laugh. Ask me for the first time you pick up the dead one in the trench. Then you learn war ain't so damn necessary. Say, you should kick <laughs> the rest of your life. Uncle Sam pays you 90 a month. Look, not a worry in the world. Don't make me laugh. Uncle Sam can take his 70 bucks and nothing good hurts. Use a crutch, Axelrod. Give the stump a rest. Mind your business, fine Schreiber. It's a sensible idea. Who asked you? Oh, look, he's ashamed. So's your Aunt Fanny. Who's got an Aunt Fanny? It's a joke. I don't want my paper creased before I read it. I want it fresh. 50 times I said that. Oh, don't get so excited for a five cent paper, our star border. And I don't want no one using my razor either. I'll get straight. I'm not buying 10 blades a week for the burger family. Maybe I'm using his razor too. <laughs> Proud. <sighs> you need luck with plants. I didn't clean off the leaves in a month. You keep the house like a pin and I like your cooking. Anytime Myron fires you, come to me, Bessie. I'll let the butler go and you can be my housekeeper. I don't like Japs so much. Sneaky. Hey, you can't tell. Maybe any day I'm coming to stay. Finish? How much, Ed Penod? <laughs> five cents. Still five cents for a haircut to fit the face? Prices don't change by me. I can't change. Now keep it. Buy yourself a packet. <laughs> Please, you keep this for me. Put it away. What is it? My insurance policy. I don't like it should lay around where someone could, something could happen. What could happen? Who knows? Robbers, fires. And they took uh, next door $50 from O'Reilly. <laughs> Say, lucky a burger didn't lose it. Put it downstairs in the safe. Bessie don't have to know. It's made out to Bessie? No, to Ralph. To Ralph? He don't know. Someday he'll get 3,000. You got good years ahead. Behind. Cigarettes. Did a call come? A few minutes. Uh, she don't let me answer it. Did Ma say I was coming back? No. She's starting that stuff again. A call come for me? A oh, wrong number. Don't lie, Bessie. Blanche said she'd call me at two. Was it her? I said a wrong number. Please, Mom, tell me if it was her. Will you call me a liar next? You got no shame to start a scene in front of Uncle Morty. Once in a blue moon, he comes. What's the shame? If my girl calls, I want to know it. You made enough mishmash with her until now. I'm surprised, Bessie. For the love of Mike, tell him yes or no. I didn't tell him? No. No. Morty, I, I didn't say before, he runs around steady with a girl. Oh, terrible. Should he run around with a foxy woxy? A girl with no parents. But often. I could die from shame. A year already he runs around with her. He brought her to help. He brought her once for supper. And believe me, she didn't come again. No. Don't think I didn't ask her. Yeah. You raised them. And what's in the end for all your trouble? When you lay in the grave, no more trouble. <laughs> quack, quack. A girl like daddy wants to marry. A skinny girl, six months already, he's not working, taking, she's not working, taking charity from an aunt. Oh, you should see her. In a year, she'll be dead on his hands. You cut her throat if you could. That's right. Before she'd ruin a nice boy's life, I would first go to prison. Miss Nobody should step in the picture and I'll stand by with my mouth shut. Miss Nobody? Who am I, Al Jolson? Fix your tie. I'll take care of my own life. 
he'll take care. Excuse my expression. You can't even wipe your nose yet. He'll take care. I'm surprised. Don't worry so much, Bessie. When it's time to settle down, he won't marry a poor girl, will you? In the long run, common sense is thicker than love. I'm a great boy for live and let live. Sure, it's easy to say. In the meantime, he eats out my heart. You know I'm not strong. I know, a pussycat. <laughs> you got money and money talks, but without the dollar, who sleeps at night? I've been working for years, bringing in money here, putting it in your hand like a kid. All right, I can't get my teeth fixed. All right, that's a new suit like, like trying to buy the, the Chrysler building. You never in your life bought me a pair of skates even. Things I died for when I was a kid. I don't care about that stuff, see, uh, only just remember, I pay some of the bills around here, just a few, and if my girl calls on the phone, I'll talk to her anytime I please. Don't be so smart, Miss America. He didn't have skates. But when he got sick, a 12-year-old boy who called a big specialist for the, for the last $25 in the house, skates. Ah, looks like snow today. It's about time. Winter. Poppy here could talk like Samuel Webster, too, but it's just talk. He should try to buy a two-cent pickle in the Berlin market without money. Ah, I'm getting an appetite. Right away, we'll eat. I made chop liver for you. Oh, my specialty. <laughs> Ralph should only be a success like you, Morty. Oh, I should only live to see the day when he rides up to the door in a big car with a chauffeur and a radio. I could die happy, believe me. Uh, success, she says. She should see how we spend thousands of dollars making up a winter line and winter don't come summer in January. Can you beat it? Don't live, just make success. Chopped liver. <laughs> ha! When they start arguing, I don't hear. Suddenly I'm deaf. I'm a great boy for the practical side. Hands like a raw potato. What's the matter? You don't look so well. No pep. I'm swell. You used to be such a pretty girl. Maybe I got the blues. You can't tell? You can stand a new dress. That's not all I could stand. Uh, come down to the place tomorrow and pick out a couple from the 1180 line. Only don't sing me the blues. Thanks. I need some new clothes. I got 2,000 pieces of merchandise waiting in the stock room for winter. I never had anything from life. Sam don't help. Now he's crazy about the kid. Crazy, or crazy is right. 21 a week he brings in. I wore my fingers off an Underwood for six years. For what? Now I wash baby diapers. Sure, I'm crazy about the kid too, but half the night the kid's up. Try to sleep? You don't know how it is, Uncle Morty. No, I don't know. I was born yesterday. <laughs> Look, someday I'll leave you a little nest egg. You like eggs? <laughs> when? When I'm dead and buried? No, when I'm dead and buried. <laughs> you should know what I'm thinking. <laughs> I know. I never take a drink. I'm just surprised at myself. I'm I got a pain. Maybe I'm hungry. Hey, come inside, Morty. Bessie's got some snaps. I'll take a drink. Yesterday, I missed the Turkish bath. I get so bitter when I take a drink. It just uh, surprises me. Eh, look how fat. Say, you live once. Quack, quack. I'll make Leon's button, no? Huh? No, let him sleep, Sam. Take away the diaper. That's your husband? Don't you know? Maybe he's a nurse you hired for the kid. It looks it, how he tends it. A guy comes howling at your old lady every time you look cockeyed. Does he sleep with you? Don't be so wise. Here's a dame strangled by her hubby with wire. Claims she didn't like him. Why don't you brain Sam with an ax some night? Why don't you lay an egg, Axelrod? I laid a few in my day, fine Schreiber, hard boiled ones too. Yeah? Yeah. You want to know what I see when I look in your eyes? No. Ted Lewis playing the clarinet. Some of those high crazy notes. Christ, you could have had a guy with some guts instead of a cluck standing around boiling baby nipples. Meaning you? Meaning me, sweetheart. Think you're pretty good. You know if I slept with you again? I'll smack your face in a minute. You do it and I'll break your arm. Take a look. 10-day luxury cruise to Havana. That's the stuff you could have had. 
put up at a ritzy hotel, Frenchy show, champagne. Now you're tied down to snake eyes here for what? What's it get you? A two by four flat on 108th Street? A pain in the bustle it gets you. What's it to you? I know you from the old days, how you like to spend it. What I mean, lizard skin shoes, perfume behind the ears. You're in a mess, paradise. Paradise, that's a fresh one. Yeah, crazy to eat knish at your own wedding. I get it, you're jealous. You can't get me. Don't make me laugh. Kid jailbird's been trying to make me for years. You'd give your other leg. I'm hooked, maybe, but you're in the same boat. Only it's worse for you. I don't give a damn no more, but you got a yen makes you going to. Don't make me laugh. Compared to you, I'm sitting on top of the world. You're losing your looks. A dame don't stay young forever. You're a liar. I'm only 24. When are you coming home to stay? Wouldn't you like to know? I'll get you again. Think so? Sure. Whatever goes up comes down. You're easy. You remember? Two for a nickel? A pushover? What's the idea? Go on. Break my arm. Listen, lousy. Go on. Do something. Listen. You're so I damn mean, tough. You like me. Take your hand off. Come around when it's a flood again and they put you in the ark with the animals. Not even then if you was the last man. Baby, if you had a dog, I'd love the dog. Gorilla. Were you here before? What? When the call came for me. What? The call came. Uh, no. When Rory Rafferty, she called back. Maybe not. I think something's the matter. What? I don't know. I took her home from the movie last night. She asked me what I'd think if she went away. Don't worry, she'll call again. Maybe not if mom insulted her. She gets it on both ends, the poor kid. Lived in an orphan asylum most of her life. They shove her around like an empty freight train. After dinner, go see her. Twice they kicked me down the stairs. Life should have some dignity. Uh, every time I go near the place, I get heart failure. The uncle drives a bus. Ugh, you ought to see him, like Babe Ruth. Use your brains. Stop acting like a kid who still wets the bed. Hire a room somewhere, a club for two members. Not that kind of proposition, Mo. Don't be a bush leaguer all of your Cut life. Cut it out. Ever sleep with one? Look, I'm blushing. You, you don't know her. I've seen her. The kind who goes, the kind no one sees undressed till Undertaker works on her. Why give me the needles all the time? What'd I ever do to you? Not a thing. You're a nice kid, but grow up. In life, there's two kinds of men. The men that are sure of themselves and the ones who ain't. It's time for you to quit being a selling platter and get your first class. And you, Axelrod? Scratch your whiskers. Get independent. Get what it takes and be yourself. Do what you like. Got a suggestion? Sure. Pick out a racket. Shake down the coconut. See what that does. We know what it does. Puts a pudding on your nose. Sing, sing. Easy money's against the law. Against the law, don't win. A racket is illegitimate, no? It's all a racket from horse racing down, marriage, politics, big business. Everybody plays cops and robbers. You got a racket yourself. Who? Me? Personally, I manufacture dresses. Horse feathers. Don't make such remarks to me without proof. I'm a great one for proof. That's why I made a success in business. Proof. Put up or shut up. Like a game of cards. I heard this remark before. A rich man's a crook who steals from the poor. Personally, I don't like it. It's a big lie. If you don't like it, buy yourself a fife and drum and go fight your own war. Sweatshop talk. Every Jew and wop in the shop eats my bread and behind my back says, a son of a bitch. I started from a poor boy who worked on an ice wagon for $2 a week. Pop's right here. He'll tell you. I made it honest. In the whole industry, nobody's got a better name. It's an exception, such success. Ralph can't do the same thing? No more than I don't think. In a house like this, he don't realize even the possibilities of life. Economics comes down like a ton of coal on the head. Red Rover, Red Rover, let Jacob come over. 
In my day, the propaganda was for God. Now it's for success. A boy don't turn around without having shoved in him. He should make success. Pop, you're a comedian, a regular Charlie Chaplin. He dreams all night of fortune. Why not? Don't it say in the movies he should have a personal steamship pajamas for, for $50 a pair and a, a toilet like a monument. But in the morning, he wakes up and for $10 and he can fix his teeth. And millions more, worse off in the mills of the South, starvation wages. The blood from the workers high. <laughs> Yeah, laugh, laugh. Tomorrow not. A real boob McNutt you're getting to be. <laughs> laugh, my son. Look, look, here is the North, Pop. North, South, it's one country. The country's all right. A duck quacks in every pot. Never heard how they shoot down men and women which ask for better wages. Kentucky, 1932. It's a pile of chopped liver, Pop. Pittsburgh. Uh, Passaic, Illinois, slavery. It begins where success begins in a competitive system. <laughs> oh, Pop, why are you bothering? Why? Tell me why. <laughs> Look, I bought you a phonograph. Stick to Caruso. Starting up again. Don't bother with Kentucky. It's full of moonshineness. Sure, 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 sure. You don't know practical affairs. Stay home and cut hair to fit the face. It says in the Bible how the Red Sea opened and the Egyptians, they went in and the sea rolled over them. In this boy's life, a Red Sea will happen again. I see it. I'm getting sore, Pop, with all this sweatshop talk. You don't stop a minute. The whole day like a phonograph. I'm surprised. Without a rich man, you don't have a roof over your head. You don't know it? You can't bite the hand that feeds you. Let him alone. He's right. Another county heard from. It's the truth. It's as plain as Keep you never see. Quiet, snot nose. For sure, charity, a bone for an old dog. But in Russia, an old man don't take charity. So his eyes turn black in his head. In Russia, they got marks. Who's marks? An outfielder for the Yanks. <laughs> Look, it, it's better than the jokes I'm telling you. This is Uncle Sam's country. Put it in your pipe and smoke it. Russia, he says. Read the papers. Here is opportunity. People can't believe in God in Russia. The papers tell the truth. They do. So you believe in God? You got something for it? You? You work for all the capitalists. You harvest the fruit from your labor. You got God. But the past conforms you. The present smiles on you. Yes, it promises you the future something. Did you found a piece of earth where you could live like a human being and die with the sun on your face? Tell me, yes. Tell me, I would like to know myself but on these questions, on this theme, this struggle for existence, you, you can't make an answer. The answer, I see, is in your face. The answer is in your mouth that can talk. In this dark corner, you sit and you die. But abolish private property. No, go fight City Hall. But he's drunk. I'm studying from books a whole lifetime. That's what it is. He's drunk. What the hell does all that mean? If you don't know, why should I tell you? You see? Hear him? Like all those nuts don't know what they're saying. I know. I know. Yeah, like Boob McNutt, you know. Don't go in the pops, in, in the spark pop. The squirrels will get you. <laughs> Save your appetite, Morty. Don't drop the duck. We're ready to eat, Mama. Shame on you. It's your second childhood. Come eat. We've had enough for one day. <laughs> quack, quack. Give him five.
They've got you pasted on the wall like a picture, Jim. Go eat, Borchik. He gives me eat, so I'll climb in the needle. One time I saw an old horse in summer, and he wore a straw hat, and the ears stuck out on the top. An old horse for hire. Give me back my young days. Give me fresh blood arms. Give me the ability to find a way. Hello? Yeah. Yeah, I, I went to the store and came right back, uh, right after you called. Speak, speak. Don't be afraid, they'll hear. I'm sorry if mom said something. You know how excitable mom is. Sure. What? Sure, I I'm listening. Uh, put on the radio, Jake. Um, yes. Yes. What's the matter? Why are you crying? What happened? She's putting her uncle on. Uh, <clears throat> yes? Listen, Mr. Hirsch, what are you trying to do? What's the big idea? Honest to God, I'm in no mood for joking. Let me talk to her. G give me Blanche. Blanche? W what's this? Was this a joke? Is this true? I I'm coming right down. I, I know, but... You want to do that? Well, I know, but... I'm coming down tonight, nine o'clock. Sure. Sure. What? Sure. What happened? Listen, Pop, I'm surprised you didn't voice <laughs> it. I, I, don't, I don't get it straight. She's leaving. Where? Out west. Cleveland. Cleveland? In a week or two. Can you picture it? It's a put up job. They can't get away with that. We'll find something. Sure, the angels of heaven will come down on her uncle's cab and whisper in his ear. Kamit will find something. I'm meeting her tonight. But I know. Maybe we'll serve you from a special blue plate supper in the garden? All right, all right. Leave the music, Bessie. I know, but she loves... Don't cry, boy chick. Why should you make like this? Tell me why you should cry. Just tell me you, you mustn't cry. Act two, scene two, later that evening. They are there to remind us of the horrors under those crosses like hundreds of thousands of workers and farmers who murdered each other in uniform for the greater glory of capitalism. The new imperialist war will send millions to their death, will bring prosperity to the pockets of the capitalists. I, Morty, and, and will bring only hunger and misery to the masses of workers and farmers. The memories of the last world slaughter are still vivid in our minds. The... Ralphie? It's getting pretty cold out. We should have steam till 12 instead of 10. Go complain to the Board of Health. It might snow. I don't hurt. Extra work for men. When I was a kid, I laid awake at nights and heard the sounds of trains. Far away, lonesome sounds, boats going up and down the river. I used to think of all kinds of things I wanted to do. What was it, Jake? Just a bunch of noise in my head? You want to make for yourself a certain kind of world? I guess I didn't. I'm feeling pretty... Pretty low. You're a young boy. And for you, life is all in front, like a big mountain. 
you got feet to climb. I don't know how. So you'll find out. Never a young man had such opportunity like today. He could make history. 10 p.m. and all is well. Where's everybody? They went. Uncle Morty too? Henny and Sam, he drove down. I saw her. Yes, yes. Tell me, tell me. I waited in the Mount Morris Park till she came out. <laughs> so cold I did a buck and wing to keep warm. She scared <laughs> to death. They made her. Sure. She wants to go. They keep yelling at her. They, they wanted to marry a millionaire, too. You told her you love her. Sure. Marry me, I said. Marry me tomorrow. I'm 16 bucks a week. On top of that, I have to admit, Mom had Uncle Morty get me fired in a second. Two can starve as cheap as one. So what happened? I made her a promise to meet me tomorrow. Now she'll, she'll go in the West? I'd fight the whole goddamn world with her. But not her. No guts. To hell with her. If she wants to go, all right. I'll get along. For sure, there's more important things than girls. <laughs> you said a mouthful. <laughs> and maybe I don't see it. She'll, she'll see what I can do. No one stops me when I get going. <laughs> Electric clippers never do a job like by hand. What? Why won't mom let her live here? Why? Why? Because in a society like this today, people don't love, hate. But gee, I'm no bum who hangs around pool parlors. I, I got the stuff to go ahead. I don't know what to do. Look on me and learn what to do, boy chick. Here sits an old man polishing tools. You think maybe I'll use them again? Look on this failure and see for 70 years he talked with good ideas, but only in the head. It's enough for me now. I should see your happiness. This is why I tell you, do, do, do what's in your heart. And you carry in yourself a revolution. But you should act. Not like me. A man who had golden opportunities but drank instead a glass tea. No, what you need... Hear it? Boston Ale Mayor, Mayor, Mayor Plain. Ten minutes late. <laughs> I get a kick of the way it cuts across the Bronx every night. You came back so soon. Where's mom? Mom, look on the chandelier. Nobody's home? Sit down right away. Uh, they're coming. You went in the street without a tie? He, it's a crime. Excuse me? You had a fight with Henny again? He'll fight once, someday. In my day, the daughter came home. Now comes the son-in-law. Once too often, she'll fight with me, Henry. I mean it. I mean it like anything. I am a person with a bad. I sit quiet, but inside I've got something. What happened? Talk to mom. I see mom. Take an apple. Oh, please, he tells me apples. Why hop around like a billiard ball? Even in a joke, she should not dare say it. My grandchild said something? My father in the old country, they, they did a joke. I, I'll tell you. One day uh, in Odessa, he talked to another Jew on the street. Uh, they didn't like it. It jumped on him like a wild wolf. Who? Plus, they cut off his beard. A Jew without a beard. He came home. I remember like yesterday how he came home and went to bed for two days. He, he put like this the cover on his face. No one should see. The third morning, he died. From what? From a broken heart. Some people are like this. They need to die like this from shame. And he told you something? Uh, straight up, she said, it, like lightning from the sky. The baby ain't mine. She said it. Don't be a dope. 
For sure, joke. She's kidding you. She should be the policeman, not some fine driver. You, you don't know her like me. I wake up in the nighttime and she sits watching me like I, I don't know what. I, I make a nice living from the store, but, but it's no use. She looks for the star in the sky. I'm afraid, like anything, you could go crazy from less, even. But what shall I do? I'll ask Mom. Go home and sleep. She'll say it's a bad dream. It don't satisfy me no more. There's such remarks that when Henry should kill in bed. Oh, don't laugh. I'm so nervous. Look, two times I wake myself on the subway station. Ah. 138, also a fortune. Let's see, you are inclined to deep thinking and had a high admiration for intellectual excellence and inclined to be very exclusive in the selection of friends. Correct. I think maybe you got mixed up in the wrong family, Sam. <laughs> oh, yes, what's, what's the matter? Something wrong with the baby? No. No. I wash my hands from everything. Take off your coat and hat. Have a seat. Excitement don't help. Myron, make some tea. You'll have a glass of tea. We'll talk like civilized people. What is it? Ralph, you all dressed up for a party? We saw a good movie with Wallace Berry. Yes. Like life. Very good. Holly Moran, too. Holly Moran, too. A woman with a nose from here to Hunts Point, but a fine player. Papa, take away the tools and the books. All right. No, Sam, why do you look like a funeral? I can't stand it. I can't. Wait, wait. you took Tootsie up the roof? In a minute. What can't you stand? She said I am second fiddle in my own house. Henry, in the second place, it ain't my baby, she said. What? What are you talking? From her own mouth, it went like a knife in my heart. Sam, what are you saying? Uh, uh, please, I'm making a story. I, I fell in the chair like dead. Such a story you believe? I don't know. How you don't know? She told me even the man. Impossible. I can't believe myself, but, but she said it. I am a second fiddle, she said. And she made such a yell everybody heard for 10 miles. Something thing Annie should say. Impossible. What should I do? That with my bad heart, such a remark kills. Annie don't feel well, Sam. You see, she has this What then? A sick that... girl. Believe me, a mother knows. Nerves. Our Annie's got a bad temper. You'll let her, she says anything. She takes after me, nervous. You ever heard such a remark in all your life? She should make such a statement. Bug house! The little one's been sick all these months. Henny needs a rest, no doubt. I don't think she means it. Yeah, well, of course, I know he don't, but of course. I'll you know. say the truth, Sam. We didn't half the time understand our, her ourselves. A girl with her own mind. When she makes it up, wild horses couldn't change her. She don't love me. This is sensible, Sam. Not for a nickel. Oh, what do you think? She married you for your money? For your looks? You ain't no John Barrymore, Sam, no? She liked you. Please, but not, not for a nickel. We stood right here the first time she said it. Sam Fine Shriver's a nice boy. She said it. A boy, he's got good common sense with a business head. Right here, she said it. In this room, you sent her two boxes of candy together, you remember? Off's candy. This is when she said it. What do you think? You were just the only boy she cared for. So she married you. Such a world. Plenty of boyfriends she had, believe me. Popular girl. Yes, Y-E-S. I'll say it plain out. Mo Axelrod offered her plenty. A servant, a house. She don't have to pick up a hand. Oh, Mo was just wild about her. The, the Mo Axelrod, he wanted to marry but her? he didn't care. A girl like Henny, you don't buy. She um, never lived to see another day if I'm telling a lie. She, she was kidding me. 
What then? You shouldn't be foolish. The, the baby looks like my family. He's got the fine driver eyes. A blind man could see it. Sure, sure. The, the, the baby looks like me, yes? You could believe me. Any day. But she tells me the man that she made up his name to. Oh, Sam. Sam, look at the phone book a million names. Calm um, down, Harry. Don't <laughs> no. stand around, Papa. Take Tootsie on the roof. And you don't let her go under the water tank. Shmeri O Israel, behold. I thought Stan, he should make things and say man eats out his heart. No, no, no. He's an old man. A second childhood. Myron, bring in the tea. Open a jar of raspberry jelly. Mom, you, you think that... I'll talk to Henny. It's all right. Uh, tomorrow, I'll take her by the doctor. Stay for a little tea. No, no, I, I'll go home. I, I've already... I, I caught the cold in this weather. Uh, you going home? I, I, I'll go in bed. I, I've caught the cold. If Teddy Roosevelt used to say, when you have a problem, sleep on it. My Sam is no problem. I don't mean, I, I mean, like he said oh, that he should be there. I'll phone supper time. Sometimes I think there's something fun about me. A bargain. Second fiddle. By me, he don't even play in the orchestra. A man like a mouse. Maybe she'll lay down and die because he makes a living. Can I talk to you about something? What's the matter? I'm biting you? It's something about Blanche. Don't tell me. Listen now. I don't want to know. She's got no place to go. I don't want to know. Mom, I love this girl. Oh, so go knock your head against the wall. I wanted to come here. L listen, Ma, I, I wanted to live here for a while. You got funny ideas, my son. I I'm as good as anybody else. Don't I have some rights in the world? Listen, Mom, if I don't do something, she's going to go away. Why don't you do it? Why don't you let us stay for a few weeks? Things will pick up and then we can- Oh, sure, sure. I'll keep her fresh on ice for a wedding day. That's what you want? No, I, I mean, you should just- I mean, You're in the same bed without marriage. No, don't say that, Mom. I, I don't mean that. I only mean- What do you mean? I know. And what I mean, I also know. Make up your mind. For your own good, Ralphie, if she dropped in the ocean, I don't lift a finger. <laughs> That's all, I suppose. With me, it's one thing. A boy should have respect for his own future. Go to sleep. You look tired. In the morning, you'll forget. Awake and sing, ye that dwell in dust, and the earth shall cast out the dead. It's cold outside? Oh, yes. I'll take up Tootsie now. He come on us like the wild man of Borneo, Sam. I, I, I don't think Henny was fool enough to tell him the truth like that. Myron. What did he say? Never mind. I heard him. I heard him. You don't need to tell me. Never mind. You trapped that guy. Don't say another word. Just have respect. That's the idea? Don't say another word. I'm boiling over ten times inside. You won't let Blanche here, huh? I'm not sure I want her. You put that one over that little shrimp. The cat's whiskers, Mom. I'm telling you something. I got the whole idea. I get it so quick, my head's swimming. Boy, what a laugh. I suppose you know about this, Jake. Yes. Why didn't you do something? I'm an old man. What's that got to do with the price of bonds? Sits around and lets a thing like that happen. You make me sick too. Let me say something, son. Now take your hands away. Sit in a corner and wag your tail. Keep on boasting you went to law school for two years. I want to tell you something that I think you is You never important. had in your life a thing to tell me. Don't say a word. Let him, let him run and tell Sam. Publish in the papers, give a broadcast on the radio. To him it don't matter nothing, his family sits with tears pouring from their eyes. What are you waiting for? I didn't tell you twice already about the dog? He'll stand around with Caruso and make a bug house. It ain't enough all day long. 50 times I told you I'll break every record in the house. The next time I say something, Maybe, maybe you'll believe it. Maybe now you've learned a lesson. Bessie, new lessons. It's not for an old dog. You didn't have to do it, Mama. Ah, oh, 
Talk better to your son, Mr. Berger. Me, I don't lay down and die for him and Papa no more. I'll work like a slave for what? Wait, the day comes when you'll be punished. When it's too late, you'll remember how you sucked away a mother's life. Talk to him. Tell him how I don't sleep at night. Goodbye to all your sorrows. You never hear him talk about the war in the land of Yama Yama. Yeah, Mama's a sick woman, Ralphie. Yeah. We'll be out of the trenches by Christmas. Putt putt here, sinker. If there's a Rhine car in the next life, I want to be a dog and lay on the fat lady's lap. Barrage over. How about a little pinochle pop? No. I'll take her up. No. I'll do it. That's cold out. I was cold before in my life. A man 67 here. Tootsie is my favorite lady in the house. She cried all last night, Tootsie. I, uh, I heard her in the kitchen. She's like a young girl. Tonight I could do something. I got a yen. I, I don't know. My scalp is impoverished. Mom busts all his records. She didn't have to do it. Tough titty. Now I can sleep in the morning. Who the hell wants to hear some wop air in the taunts all day long? Uh, oh, paradiso. It's snowing out, girls. There's, there's no more big snows like in the old days. You know, I, I think the whole world's changing. I see it right under our very eyes. No one hardly remembers anymore when we used to have gaslight and, and, and all the, the dishes that had little fishes on them. It's a system, girls. I was a little boy when it happened. The Great Blizzard. It, it's, it's no three days without a stop that time. Yes, and, and, and the horse car stopped. A silence of death was on the city. And um, yeah, little babies got no milk. They say a lot of people died that year. Lights are blinking while you're drinking. That's the place the good fellas go. Goodbye to all your sorrows. You never hear him talk about the war in the land of Yama Yama. Fanicoli, Fanicola, Fanicolo. What can I say to you, big boy? Not a damn word. Ta -ta -ra -ta -ra -ta -ra -ta -ra. I know how you feel about all those things. I, I know. I know. Forget it. Your girl. I, I Don't soft soap me all of a sudden. I'm not foreign born. I'm an American, yet I've never got close to you. It's an American father's duty to be his son's friend. Who said that, Teddy? Uh? You're breaking his heart, Litva. It just happened the other day. The moment I began losing my hair, I just knew I was destined to be a failure in life. And, and, and when I grew bald, I was. Now, isn't that funny, big boy? Isn't that funny? It's a piss cutter. I, I believe in destiny. You get what's it take. Then they don't catch you with your pants down. Eight of clubs. I really don't know. I, I sold jewelry on the road before I got married. It's one thing to... Well, now, here's the thing the druggist gave me. Listen, the Marvel cosmetic girl of Hollywood is going on the air. Give this charming little radio singer a name and win $5,000. If you will send us just Goldman her name. still believes in Santa Claus? Someone's got to win. <laughs> the government isn't going to go allow everything to be a fake. It's a fake. There ain't no price. It's a fake. It says right here, if you just Christ met... sake, Pop, forget it. Grow up. Jake's right. Everybody's crazy. It's like a zoo in this house. I'm going to bed. In the land of yummy. Yum. Don't think life's easy with mama. No, but you know, she means for your good all the time. I tell you, she does. Maybe, but I'm going to bed. Enemy barrage begins on sector 8075. Uh, it's the door downstairs. We ain't expecting anybody this hour of the night. Lights are blinking while you're drinking. That's the place where the good fellows go. I bet it's how it is. I'll take the button. Whoever is ringing means it. Who's ringing like a lunatic? What's the matter? Mama. Oh, what's the matter? What's the matter? Well, well? What? Papa, he, he, he. What happened? Wait, who? He, he slipped. Maybe in the snow. Who slipped? Your your father fall off the roof. Yeah. My Myron. 
call Morty on the phone. Call him. No, I'll do it myself. I'll, I'll do it. Since I was in this country, I, I was putting out the ash can. The snow is wet. Scram. He, he slipped. Slipped? I, I can't see the numbers. M make it, mo make it. Uh, make it yourself. Riverside 7? Don't, don't make me laugh. Act three, a week later, Morty, Bessie, and Myron are eating and having a conversation. Mo is marking a dope sheet and listening. You're sure he'll come tonight, the insurance man? Why not? I stoked him a $10 bill. Everything's hot delicatessen. Why must he come so soon? Because you had a big expense. You'll settle once and for all. I'm, I'm a great boy for making hay while the sun shines. Stay till he comes, Morty. No, I got a strike downtown. Business don't stop for personal life. Two times already in the past week, those bastards threw stink bombs in the showroom. Wait, we'll give them strikes in the Kishkas will give him. I'm a woman. I don't know about policies. Stay till he comes. Bessie, sweetheart, let me live. I'm afraid, Morty. Be practical. They made an investigation. Everybody knows Pop had an accident. Now we'll collect. Ralph, we don't know Papa left the insurance in his name. It's not his business, and I'll tell him. The way he feels, he'll do something crazy. He thinks Papa jumped off the roof. Be practical, Bessie. Ralphie will sign when I tell him. Everything is peaches and cream. Wait for a few minutes. Look, I'll show you in black on white what the policy says. For God's sake, let me live. What's the letter say? Blanche won't come see me no more, she says. I couldn't care very much, she says. If I didn't come like I said, she'll phone before she leaves. She don't know about Pop? She won't ever forget me, she says. <laughs> Look what she sends me, a little locket on a chain. If she calls, I'm, I'm out. You mean it? For a week, I'm trying to go in his room. I guess he'd like me to have it, but I just can't get myself- Wait a minute. They're trying to look you a uh, freeze out. Who? The bunch stuffing their guts with hot pastrami. Morty in particular. Jake left the insurance, $3,000 for you. For me? Now you got wings, kid. Popping it out, you could use it. That's why. That's why what? It ain't the only reason he done it. He done it? You think a breeze blew him off? I'm not sure what I think. The insurance guy's coming tonight. Morty stooped him. Yeah? I'll back you up. You're dead on your feet. Grab sleep for yourself. No. Go on. Morty wants the paper. Oh? You're sitting we could go home now, Henry. Uh, Leon is alone by Mrs. Strasburg a whole day. Go on home if you're so anxious. A full tub of diapers is waiting. Why should you act this way? Because there's no bones in ice cream. Don't touch me. Please, but what is the matter? She don't like you. Plain as the face on your nose. I me, mean, my friend, you talk like a foreign language. A quarter, you're lousy. Give me a buck, I'll run it up to 10. Don't do me no favors. I take a chance. I'm a pushover. I say lots of things. You don't know me. I know you. When you knock them down, you're through. You still don't know me. I know what goes on in your wise guy head. Don't run away. I ain't got hydrophobia. Wait, I wanna tell you, I'm leaving. Leaving? Tonight, already packed. Where? My car goes through snow like a dose of salts. Penny, go eat. Where's Ralphie? In his new room. I didn't have a piece of, a piece of hot pastrami in my mouth for years. Make a sandwich, Henny. You didn't eat all day. 
Oh, we get rained, cats and dogs. Rain, rain, go away. Come again some other day. Where's my gloves? I'm sorry the old man plays in the red. Personally, Pop was a fine man. But I'm a great boy for an honest opinion. He had enough crazy ideas for a regiment. Pop had never had a doctor in his whole life. <laughs> yeah, Caruso. Who's got more from life? Who's got more? Marks he had. Marx. Some say Marx is the new god today. Maybe I'm wrong, <laughs> but personally, I counted my 10 million last night. I'm 16 cents short. So tomorrow, I'll go to Union Square and yell, no equality in the country. <laughs> it's a new generation. You said it. What's the matter, Ralphie? Why are you looking so funny? I hear I'm left insurance and the man's coming tonight. Papa didn't leave no insurance for you. What? It's in your name he left it, but not for you. It's my name on the paper. Who said so? The insurance man's coming tonight. What's the matter? I'm not talking to you. Why? I, I don't know why. He don't come in this house tonight. <laughs> That's what you say. I'm not talking to you, Uncle Morty. But I'll tell you too, he don't come here tonight while there's still mud on the grave. Couldn't you give this house a chance to cool off? Is this a way to talk to your mother? Was that a way to talk to your father? Don't be so smart with me, Mr. Ralph Berger. Don't be so smart with me. What do you do? I say he's coming tonight. Who says no? Me. Take a back seat, Axelrod. When you're in the family... I got then... a new document here. I found it under the pillow that night. The guy who slips off the roof, don't leave a note before he does it. Let me see this note. Morty, don't touch it. Not if you crawled. It's a fake. Papa wouldn't... Get the insurance guy here and we'll see how. Speak of the devil. Answer it. See what happens. Morty, don't. Sometimes you don't collect on suicides if they know about it. You should be, you should let it. Well, we're all waiting. Give me the note. I'll give you the head off your shoulders. Bessie, you're going to stand for this? Pull down his pants, give him with a strap. How about the bell? Uh, don't be, don't be crazy. It's not my fault. Morty, Morty said he should come tonight. It's not nice so soon. I didn't. I said it? Me? Who oh, then? You didn't sing a song in my ear the whole week to settle up quick. I'm surprised. Morty, you're a big liar. Mom is telling the truth. She is. <laughs> Listen, in two shakes of a lamb's tail, we'll start a real fight and then nobody won't like nobody. Where's my fur gloves? I'm going downstairs. You coming? I'll drive you down. Don't look at me. Go home if you want. If you're coming soon, I'll wait. Don't do me any favors. Night and day he pesters me. You made a cushion. Sleep. I'll go home. I, I know. To my worst enemy, I won't miss such a life. Sam, keep quiet. No more free speech in America? <laughs> I'm the lonely person that nobody likes me. I like you, Sam. Please, go home, Sam. I'll sleep here. I'm tired and nervous. Tomorrow I'll come home. I love you. I mean it. I will die for you. A bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. Remember I said it. Good night. Yesterday a man wanted to sell me a saxophone with pearl buttons. If I look at him and I say... Beautiful picture. I, I, in this land, nobody works, nobody worries. Come to bed, Myron. Please don't have foolish ideas about the money, Ralph. Call it a day. It belongs for the whole family. You'll get your teeth fixed. And a pair of black and white shoes. H and Henny needs a vacation. She'll take two weeks in the mountains and I'll mind the baby. I'll take care of my own affairs. A family needs for a rainy day. 
Times is getting worse. Prospect Avenue, Dawson, Beck Street, everyday furniture's on the sidewalk. Forget it, Mom. Ralphie, I worked too hard all my years to be treated like dirt. It's no law we should be stuck together like Siamese twins. Summer shoes you didn't have, skates you never had, but I bought a new dress every week? A lover I kept? Mr. Gigolo? Did I ever play a game of cards like Mrs. Marcus? Or was Bessie's Burgers children always the cleanest on the block? Here, I'm not only the mother, but also the father. The first two years, I worked in a stocking factory for $6 while Myron Burger went to law school. If I didn't worry about the family, who would? On the calendar, it's a different place. But here, without a dollar, you don't look the world in the eye. Talk from now to next year, this is life in America. Then it's wrong. It don't make sense. If life made you this way, then it's wrong. Maybe you wanted me to give up 20 years ago. Where would you be now? You'll excuse my expression. You'd be a bum in the park. I'm not blaming you, Mom. Sink or swim, I see it. But it can't stay like this. My foolish boy. No. Every house lousy with lies and hate. He said it, Grandpa. Brooklyn hates the Bronx. Smacked on the nose twice a day, but boys and girls can get ahead like that, Mom. We don't want life printed on dollar bills, Mom. Well, go out and change the world if you don't like it. I will. And why? Because life's different in my head. Give me the earth in two hands. I'm strong. There. Hear him? Air mail off to Boston. Day or night, he flies away. Job to do. That's us, and it's no time to die. <laughs> Mom, what does she know? She's old fashioned. But I'll tell you a big secret. My whole life I wanted to go away too. But with children, a woman stays home. A fire burned in my heart too, but now it's too late. I'm no spring chicken. The clock goes and Bessie goes. Only my machinery can't be fixed. Well, I guess I'm no prize bag. Come to bed, Myron. Mm. Mm. Look at him, dragging after like an old shoe. Punch drunk. That's for me. Yeah? Just a minute. Your girl. Jeez, I don't know what to say to her. Hang up. Hello? Blanche? I, I wish I... Well, I don't know what to say. Yes. Hello? She hung up on me. Sorry? <laughs> no girl means anything to me until I- Till when? Till I take care of her. Till we don't look out on an air shaft. Till we can take the world in two hands and polish off the dirt. That's a big order. Once upon a time, I thought I'd drown to death in bolts of silk and velour. But I grew up these last few weeks. Jake said a lot. Your memory's okay? But take a look at this. His books. I got them too. Pages ain't cut in half of them. Perfect. Does it prove something? Dan Tootin, a ten set nail file cuts them. Uptown, downtown, I'll read them on the way. Get a big lamp over the bed. My eyes are good. Sure, inventories tomorrow. Coletti to Driscoll to Burger. That's how we work. It's a team down at the warehouse. Driscoll's a show off, a wise guy, and Joe talks pigeons all day and night. But they're like me, looking for a chance to get to first base, too. Joe razzed me about my girl, but <laughs> he don't know why. I'll tell him. Hell, he might tell me something I don't know. Get teams together all over. Spit on your hands, get to work. And enough with teams together, maybe we'll steam in the warehouse so our fingers don't dry off. Maybe we'll fix it so life won't be printed on dollar bills. Graduation day. Can I have Grandpa's note? Sure, you want it? Please. It was blank. That's right. Thanks. The kid's a fighter. Why are you crying? I never cried in my life. You told Sam you love him. 
if I'm so sore on life, why take it out on him? You won't forget me to your dying day. I was the first guy, part of your insides. You won't forget. I wrote my name on you, indelible ink. One thing I won't forget, how you left me crying on the bed like I was two for a cent. Listen, do you think that if you were- Sure, wait till the family goes to the open air movie. He brings me perfume. He, he grabs my arms. You won't forget me. How you left the next week? So I made a mistake, for Christ's sake. Don't act like the Queen of Romania. Don't make me laugh. What the hell do you want? My head on a plate? Was my life so happy? Christ, my old man's a bum. I was sported the whole damn family, five kids and mom. When they grew up, they beat it the hell away like rabbits. Mom died, I went to war. Got clapped down like a bed bug. Woke up in a room without a leg. What the hell do you think? Anyone's got it better than you? I never had a home either. I'm looking too. So what? So you're it. You're home for me, a place to live. That's the whole parade. Sickness, eating out your heart. Sometimes you meet a girl, she stops it. That's love. So take a chance. Be with me, paradise, what's to lose? My pride. What do you want? Say the word, I'll tango on a dime. Don't give me ice when your heart's on fire. Let me go. Where? What do you want, Mo? What do you want? You! You'll be sorry you ever even started. You! This. Mo, let me go. I'm getting up early. Just let me go. No. I got enough fever to blow the whole damn town to hell. You want to go back to him? Say the word. I'll know what to do. Mo, I, I don't know what else to say. Listen to me. What? Come away with me. A certain place where it's moonlight and roses will lay down and count stars. Hear the big ocean making noise. You lay under the tree. Champagne flows like Hello? A minute. Who is it? Same. I'm sleeping. She's sleeping. He wants you to know he got home okay. What's on your mind? Nothing. Sam? They say it's a palace on those Havana boats. What's on your mind? Mo... <sighs> I don't care for Sam. I never loved him. But you kid. All my life I waited for this minute. Me too. Me believe I was talking just bedroom golf. But you and me forever. That's what I meant. Christ, baby, there's one life to live. Live it. Leave the baby? Yeah. I, I, I can't. You can. No. But you're not sure. I don't know. Make a break or spend the rest of your life in a coffin. Oh God, I don't know where I stand. Don't look up there. Paradise, you're on a big boat headed south. No more pins and needles in your heart. No snake juice squirting in your arm. The whole world's green grass. And when you cry, it's because you're happy. No, I don't know. Nobody knows. But do it and find out. When you're scared, the answer's zero. You're hurting my arm. The doctor said it. Cut off your leg and save your life. And they done it. One thing for another. I didn't hear a word. But do it, Henny. Do it. Mom can mind the kid. She'll go on forever, Mom. We'll send money back and Easter eggs. I'll be here. Get your coat. Get it. Mo. I know. But get your coat and your hat. Kiss the house goodbye. The man I love? I left my coat in mom's room. Don't wake her up, beauty. Mama fell asleep as soon as her head hit the pillow. I can't sleep. It was a long day. Ah. I was reading the other day, a person with a thick tongue is feeble-minded. I can do anything with my tongue. Make it thick, flat. Is, there's uh, no fruit in the house lately, just a lone apple. 
must be something wrong with me. I, I say I won't eat, but then I eat. And where are you going, Little Red Riding Hood? Nobody knows, Peter Rabbit. You're looking very pretty tonight. You were a beautiful baby, too. 1910, that was the year you were born. That was the same year Teddy Roosevelt come back from Africa. Gee, Pop, you're such a funny guy. He's a boisterous man, Teddy. Yeah. And good night. When I look at him, I'm sad. Let me tie like a dog if I can't get more from life. Where? Right here in the house. My days won't be for nothing. Let mom have the dough. I'm 22 and kicking up. I'll get along. Did Jake die for us to fight about nickels? No. Awake and sing, he said. Right here, he stood and said it. The night he died, I saw it like a thunderbolt. I saw he was dead and I was born. I swear to God, I'm one week old. I, I want the whole city to hear it. Fresh blood, arms, we got him. We're glad we're living. I wouldn't trade you for two pitches and an outfielder. Hold the fort. So long. So long. I know a place you never could taste in geography. Where can it be? Come on with me. Well, I never was there, but I hear it's a bear. Ah, you even see. It's just like old Napoli. In the land of 